I, Jordan, take you, Kristen, to be my wedded wife. I, Kristen, take you, Jordan, to be my husband. To have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, I will love and cherish you as, as a treasure from God. God. From this day on, I, I pledge my love to you. Take your Four years you've been my friend. You've seen the best of me and the worst of me. We've gone from not saying a word to each other for years to talking every single day. I feel so blessed to have shared all my experiences, good and bad, with you. You've calmed me down when I've been mad. You've listened to me when I didn't even understand what I was saying. You see me laugh and cry. See me when I was afraid and you accept me as I am. I promise to be the man you need me to be, to be the man who cares for you, provides for you, and gives you security. And I promise to be transparent and, and honest with you in all things. I promise to put your needs above my own, even if that means wash the Kardashians instead of the family guy. <laughs> Big or small, I'll put you first. I promise to keep opening the door for you. I promise to learn what you like, learn what you don't like, learn what makes you angry and try to avoid those things. Learn what you're afraid of and learn what you dream of. I may not have much I can give, but I promise you this. Even though I only have two hands, I'll work them to the bone for you. I've only got two feet, but I'll walk mile after mile for you. I've got one back, and even though it aches sometimes, I'll endure the pain for you. My arms aren't the biggest or the strongest, but I'll use all the strength I have to protect you. I've got one heart, and even though the beats left are numbered, I vow to spend every last one loving you. I love every part of you with every part of me. I love you, Kristen. Jordan, never in a million years would I have thought I'd be standing here marrying the man I never spoke to at a high school group. <laughs> I had dreamt of a man like you and prayed that I would one day be blessed to marry a man so selfless, loyal, and caring. You have showed me how to stand up for myself and the things I believe in. 
You push me when I need to be pushed and continue to stand by my side to watch me grow into the woman God has made me. You always seek the best option for us and strive to make this relationship a godly one. Today and the rest of our lives, I promise to follow your guidance and allow you to lead us. I promise to trust your words and actions. I promise to make our lives and home the one we want that also celebrates our faith. I promise to enjoy the happiness in our lives and stand by you when life gets challenging. I promise to care for you in your sick days, even make you quesadillas. I promise to keep our friendship refreshing and loving. Jordan Luke Lavanino, I promise to always be your best friend and to love you more and more from this day forward. For as much as Jordan and Kristen have consented together in holy wedlock and have pledged their faith to each other, I now declare by the authority committed to me as a minister of the gospel that they are now husband and wife, according to the ordinance of God and the law of the state. That God is joined together today, let no one separate. You may kiss your wife. all these years and I couldn't be any happier that she found her perfect man to be by her side for the rest of her life. So thank you. Kristen, <laughs> I love you so much. Um, thank you for being the best friend that I could ever have. Um, and um, I've been so blessed to have you in my life for so long. So now if you all join me in a toast. <laughs> Kristen and Jordan, may the rest of your days together be filled with multiple cups of coffee when the mornings are up, bowls of ice cream after those long stressful days, but most importantly, love and laughter on any ordinary day, because anyone can be passionate, but it takes real lovers to be silly. To Kristen and Jordan. Yeah. Onto the smart idea was uh, choosing this beautiful girl right here to marry him. I've seen nothing but growth from their relationship and I know this man would give anything and everything for Kristen and I know you would do just the same Kristen. Uh, I just hope that you give him as much love as he gives you through the years, which is going to be hard because this is a loving man. <laughs> so uh, yeah, uh, let's all toast to this a uh, beautiful couple that will be leaving us in a couple months, which we're not happy about, but good on you guys. <laughs> uh, to Jordan and Kristen for a lifelong, happy and beautiful marriage. Mm -hmm.